Hey guys, what is up? It's Duncan, and today I have a special video on how to make your PC look like a Mac. This has nothing to do with iPods or iPhones or anything like normally. This is just a kind of a cool thing. I'm going to show you how to download a program, uh, edit some settings, or basically to make your PC look like a, a Mac. I'm running Vista right here, and as you can see, it is not perfect, but it looks decently like a Mac. So anyway, let's get this one started. Okay guys, so how we begin this is the first thing you might want to do is download this wallpaper, which is a pretty standard Mac wallpaper that you might want. Um, I will have a link for it in the sidebar. Anyway, so okay, so the first thing that you want to do is download the program, Rocket Doc. Okay, so open up your browser, whatever it is, and basically what you will do is come up, wait for it to load, come up to the top and go to Rocket Doc. Com. I will have, uh, with ev as with everything, I'll have links in the description. Anyway, so then come over here to download. And it's real simple. You see this is the latest version. Go ahead, click it, download it, run through it. It's very simple, very easy. Um, download it, install it. You don't have to open it up yet. There's still a few more things we need to do. But yeah. Okay, now, one of the main things is there's skins for it. Um, the standard version doesn't come with the Mac skin, so you'll probably want to go ahead and do this. Again, this is optional. If you want to mess around with it, that's fine. Okay, so you will hit go add, get add-ons, I'm sorry. Um, I'll have links for this as well. Um, skins, and then go ahead and hit downloads, and then Mac OS X, OS 10. Wow, that was, that was bad. OS 10. <laughs> anyway, so you hit the OS 10 Leopard Skin. You hit download the file, download it wherever you want. Um, and this is a little complicated right here. You will go ahead and download it. Then you will need to unzip it, however you want to unzip it. Um, I've already got a link to it right here. But basically, what you do is you will unzip it, and then you go into your program files, whether it's whatever drive it's on, and go into the Rocket Doc file. You will take the file that you unzipped and drag it into Skins. That's all you have to do. Once you drag it into skins, uh, and then Rocket Doc will recognize it, and you'll be good to go. Okay, so let's go bring this back up. Cancel this out. Okay, so the next thing that you will want to do is go ahead and open up Rocket Doc. Um, I've got all of my links down here, so I'll go ahead and open it up. And here you go. Um, and this is with the Mac skin. Obviously, you see it's not quite perfect, but this is this is uh, mostly there. Um, now I've customized this a lot. When it first comes, it will come pretty bare. You will have to go ahead and get this skin right down here and uh, add a lot of stuff. But all you have to do—it's real simple. There's lots of options. You can experiment, get it going, and it's a lot of fun. Anyway, so once you do that, there's only a couple things left. Um, now you see here, I've got my uh, whole desktop blank. Um, what you'll want to do if you want to make it really nice and clean is get rid of any files or anything that you want, uh, move them off, do whatever you want clear it up and then with your recycle bin go ahead and just I don't have it up right here but you right click it hit delete and it will go away you can still use it uh, it's not like it's gone or anything and as you can see here you can put it on your dock and be set now it looks close right but obviously there's one thing this taskbar so basically what you want to do is just right click and just go down here right click a part portion of it that's not used by the dock go ahead and open up properties um, now, th this is for Vista, obviously. I'm not going to go and uh, I'm not sure exactly how it would work on XP, but it it would be probably something similar. Anyway, so see this uh, auto hide the taskbar? Go ahead and click it, hit apply, and then go ahead and X out of this. And here we go. Simple as that. We've got nothing on the screen except when we got our dock here. We can open up any of our programs. Now, obviously, you can add anything down there you want. You can customize Rocket Dock. There's a lot of really cool things. Um, anyway, I hope this guy, this tutorial helped you guys. Um, I know I'm, I'm liking it a lot. It's a little, it's a little uh, difficult to use um, sometimes, so you might not m want to use this all the time. And obviously, it's totally customizable. You can uh, obviously you see I, that'll come right back up whenever I want. And you can move the rock, the dock to the left, to the top, to the right, anywhere you want on the screen, depending on how it works for you. Anyway. Um, Really quickly here, I had a little bit of a mix-up with the giveaway for the five promo codes for Not Guide.
So basically what I'm doing is go ahead and I'm going to give away five promo codes for the application not guide. I will have the link for the review for not guide in the description. Um, I have the five I have five promo codes for it and I'll be going ahead going ahead and giving them away on this video, seeing as I wasn't very clear about it on the previous video. So guys if you want uh, if you want to get in on the giveaway for five one of the five promo codes for not guide, just go right below in your comments say not guide dash your comment. Simple as that. Uh, nothing to it, and you will be entered. And I will probably let me see here, probably give it away on Wednesday or so. Anyway, and I've also got one quick thing: the tomorrow the Worldwide Developers Conference is going to be on, and uh, definitely, guys, check that out. Um, I'm going to be watching it, and uh, if there's anything new coming out, I will cover it as soon as I can. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I hope this tutorial helped. Be sure to check out Zizzard.com for the latest app reviews iPhone and iPod Touch news, tips and tricks for your device, jailbreaking information and more. Thanks for watching.